Uh, hey, V. About to start. You, uh, you gotta take a piss or something? Uh, now's the time. Thanks for your concern. Let's start this rodeo. <laughs> Can't just yet. Not till you get in the range. Go on, set up. Chop, chop. Alrighty, how many we got? Just six? God damn. Crying about it. <clears throat> Rules are simple, right? There's the target, shoot it. Don't matter which one, go on and shoot your neighbors. Most hits wins. Uh, meaning hits on the target, not your neighbor. Oh, right, uh, small caliber iron only. Don't go showing off with your fucking assault bangers or no rocket pukers, got me? First prize is a pistol. But, uh, a, a real nice one. Fucking nice, I'm telling you. Anyway, uh, tough words. Get worked up. Ready? Three, two. Hey, hey, the hell is that? The hell are you doing with that double barrel? Said small caliber only. Uh, forgot my iron. Must be in my other jacket. And that's what you keep your gun in a holster. A holster! Get the fuck out of my sight, now! Fuck, Chum. Chill. I'm going. I'm going. <sighs> Pearls before swine, for fuck's sake. <sighs> Alright. Three. Two. One. Lead punks, learn to shoot! Out of my sight! Now! Thanks, Wilson. It sure is pretty. Uh-huh. Yeah. See you around, Wilson. Till next time. Remembering that right? Who is it? V, your neighbor from upstairs. Remember me? Talked about Prem rides. Back then you were pumped about the Mizutani Shion. I said it was for flash posers. <laughs> you don't forget a gunk thing like that. You gave me this look. I was about to hightail it to the Badlands right then and there. I remember. What do you want? Want to see what was shaking? Friends say you never leave your unit. Think I've got an inkling as to why. I've seen that look before. It's all too common among people like us. Us? <laughs> you don't look like a cop. Badges don't get a monopoly on loss. You see death every day in my line of work. And you get used to it, of course. Until it hits someone you're close to. You too.
Come in. I lost someone close to me, too. A damn good friend. What do you mean, too? Wait. This is about Andrew. They, uh... Told you about him. Best bud I ever had. Known in my whole life. Only person I could spill it to. You didn't have anyone to unload on at work? How about Petrova and Mendez? And Petrova's a decent gal, but... She's not good with this stuff. Mendez? Just doesn't get it. He thinks us blues need to be tough. Can't bear the sight of a kid getting murdered. Born with pussy genes. According to him. But you told him about Andrew. Honestly? Thought about it a lot. Anyway, they don't know everything. Better that way. Can you tell me how Andrew died? Doesn't matter. Normally. From old age. It's no wonder, seeing as he was only a few years younger than my grandma. Dying of old age? In Night City? That merits a monument. The whole world should gaze up at it in awe. <laughs> so then Andrew is more like a grandpa to you than a friend? <laughs> Wouldn't go that far. He was like a... Uh, I don't know. A window into the past or something. He reminded me of my gram grams about our little talks. Time when everything had its proper place. You know, he was the last living record. Mendez doesn't know shit about life. Everyone's got their limits, even him. He just hasn't reached them. Not like you. What if he's right, though? Maybe my genes are soft. Don't only the strongest survive? If he felt nothing, that means his loss wouldn't have had any meaning. I guess so. Thanks for the talk, V. I am. Um, I need time to take all this in. Sure thing. Take care.